I'm Jeff Ballone. I'm the sixth generation of our family farm and we farm around 4,000 acres and there's four of us, my dad and I, and then two hired men and I've been doing it for about seven years now. Um, we have primarily uh, conventional tillage but we do do some direct seeding. Um, we're just kind of dabbling in it right now. And I've seen a lot of people do it around us and uh, I figured we'd give it a try. How much rainfall do you get on average throughout your farm? At this farm particularly we get about eight inches annually. We need to uh, make sure that moisture is there come seeding time. Um, obviously with eight inches of rain annually it's very hard to do. Um, so a lot of times we got to seed deep and it takes a long time for that weed to germinate and get up tall enough where it'll actually make a crop. Just since I've been uh, farming, I, we've went through four different varieties uh, just because there's so much technology and seed varieties coming down the pipeline. Um, the, just the winter hardiness. Around here, we can have no snow or we can have three feet of snow. It just, it's very, it, it varies so much. And the new varieties are obviously winter hardy for us and so we like to try new things, dabble in it and see, see what it does for us. We have two young boys. Our kids are often in the tractor riding with dad. Um, it absolutely has to be safe, not only for them to be out there, um, but for the wheat that's going to go out to the consumers. Technology's made huge improvements over the last 10 years and is what we're, we're going to see those same amount of improvements every year now going down the line. I think We're not blanket spraying, um, putting all that chemicals on the ground, um, and it's, it's promoting a lot better soil health. Um, a customer that ran this technology last year said he's, he had the best canola stand he's ever got last fall, and he knows it's from not blanket spraying chemicals. You try to do the best possible job you can because your livelihood depends on it. You put your blood, sweat, and tears into it. It's your livelihood.